that is so wonderful. And you know what's me TV has to support. In 2008, philanthropic giving in the U.S. totaled $300 billion. That's more than the GDP of Colombia. And listen to this. From 1995 to 2005, the number of foundations in the U.S. increased by 77%. With so many resources directed at solving our social issues, why do they seem to be getting worse instead of better? I can't think of any two more polar opposite things than charity, which is giving money without any expectation of anything in return, and effective social investing, which is giving money highly strategically with a calculation constantly in mind of understanding what social value the money is producing. It's really important to understand what you're doing and why you're doing it, but it can be done and it, and it has to be done. And we owe that to people. We have to be diligent about it. And th you can think of it as any other investment. You would never just invest in a corporation and just walk away and kind of hope that it did well. You would be anticipating a return on that investment. It is seen as a virtue in most foundations in America and for many, many donors that we only give, and the, with an emphasis on the word give, because it's seen as a gift, not as an investment. We only give program dollars. But who the hell delivers programs? It's the organization that delivers programs. Programs aren't floating in the air. More funding isn't the answer. Smarter funding is the answer. You can't track it, you shouldn't do it. You just should period, it's immoral. Really, you're taking somebody else's money, get in somebody else's life to try to make a difference. You better be showing you can make a difference. <laughs> it's about people's lives. It's, these are life and death issues. Every dollar that's being spent to try to help people needs to help people. And the vast majority of it isn't helping anybody. We fund organizations based on their performance. Then we can solve some of the social issues that we have today. We fund organizations that are effective, or we fund organizations so that they can determine if what they're doing is effective. If we have more dollars going to performance management, then more organizations will know if what they're doing is actually having the intended effect. The reason why it's absolutely essential for, for uh, social service agencies to manage outcomes is if they don't, they have actually no way of knowing whether they are doing uh, any good at all or whether they are actually potentially doing harm. And if you are actually doing harm or producing no social value but represent an enormous opportunity cost for all the resources you're using up, you should go out of business.